Every time you board a plane, you walk past details that could save your life, yet almost no one knows what they do. From strange markings on the engines to mysterious hooks on the wings, commercial aircraft are filled with hidden design secrets that most passengers overlook completely. In this video, we'll uncover 12 airplane features airlines never explain, the safety systems, engineering tricks, and coded signals that keep modern aviation running safely behind the scenes. Stay tuned until the end to discover how one of these tiny features could make the difference between disaster and survival. Before we take off, make sure to subscribe to Epic Voyage for more fascinating travel and aviation stories every week. Look closely at the nose cone of a jet engine and you'll see a white or silver spiral painted on it. It might look like decoration, but it's actually one of the simplest and most effective safety devices in the aviation industry. When an engine starts, the blades rotate at speeds exceeding 10,000 revolutions per minute. At that point, the suction near the intake can pull in objects or even people from several meters away. Ground crews working close to aircraft need a clear visual cue that an engine is live, because it's almost silent from a distance. That's why engineers began painting spirals in the 1980s, to catch the human eye immediately. As the cone spins, the pattern blurs into a hypnotic whirl, unmistakable even in low light or rain. It warns technicians to stay back, reducing the chance of accidents in crowded airports where several engines may be idling at once. Some airlines use circular swirls, others use curved comma shapes that seem to dance as they spin. The design doesn't matter, the life-saving effect does. If you've ever sat by the emergency exit and stared out at the wing, you might have noticed small metal fixtures that look like bolts. They're not cosmetic, they're rescue anchors. In a water landing, inflatable slides double as rafts, but passengers seated over the wing have to evacuate across its slick surface. To prevent chaos, ropes are clipped between those hooks and the doors, creating a handline that guides people safely into lifeboats. These systems were developed after early studies of evacuations showed that even strong swimmers struggled to balance on the smooth, fuel-coated wings of downed aircraft. The modern hook-and-rope solution gives rescuers control and helps passengers move in a single direction away from the engines. They are tested repeatedly under strict regulations from the Federal Aviation Administration and the European Union Aviation Safety Agency. Few travelers ever notice them, but in the rare moments they're needed, they turn confusion into order and save lives. When those yellow masks fall, people imagine massive oxygen tanks hidden in the ceiling. In reality, that would add hundreds of kilograms to the aircraft. Instead, there's a compact miracle of chemistry, the chemical oxygen generator. Inside a small metal canister is a mixture of sodium chlorate and iron powder. When you pull the mask's cord, it ignites a chemical reaction that produces oxygen gas and heat, around 400 degrees Celsius inside the cartridge. The system starts instantly and keeps flowing for about 12 to 20 minutes. That's long enough for the pilots to descend to 10,000 feet, where outside air is breathable. The warmth you might feel is harmless, a sign that the generator is working. These devices are replaced regularly and stored with tamper-proof seals. Their reliability rate is above 99.9%, .9%, a figure that's been proven over millions of flights. It's one of aviation's most efficient life support systems, invisible until the moment it's needed. The black box is the heart of every investigation after an accident, yet it's bright orange, so it can be found easily among wreckage or under the sea. Each aircraft carries two recorders. The flight data recorder captures everything from altitude and speed to control surface movement, while the cockpit voice recorder stores the last two hours of crew conversation and alarms. Both are encased in titanium, designed to survive impacts exceeding 3,400 g-forces and temperatures of 1,100 degrees Celsius. The locator beacon inside sends acoustic pings every second for up to 30 days. In 2009, signals from the Air France Flight 447 recorders guided search teams to debris nearly 4 kilometers below the Atlantic. These boxes don't just tell investigators what went wrong, they teach the entire industry how to prevent it from happening again. Every safety improvement, from stall warning systems to better pilot training, owes something to the lessons recorded in those orange boxes. Look up, next time you step inside the cabin. The subtle grooves above the overhead bins hide built-in handrails for flight attendants. During turbulence, these rails are a lifeline. They allow crew members to move through the aisle without grabbing seatbacks or shoulders, keeping passengers comfortable and reducing injuries. The rails were introduced after early jetliners experienced severe turbulence that caused crew injuries. Modern cabin design blends safety with aesthetics, 
so the rails are hidden to keep interiors sleek while maintaining practicality. They're tested with forces equal to several times a person's weight to ensure they can support a crew member even in sudden drops. It's another invisible feature you'll likely never use, but someone relies on it every single flight. Airplanes can't honk at each other in the sky, but they do have horns, used exclusively on the ground. The cockpit horn button alerts maintenance teams when pilots need immediate assistance or clearance. For instance, if the aircraft loses external power or requires a final inspection before pushback, the pilot sounds a sharp electronic tone. The sound varies by manufacturer. Airbus uses a quick buzz, bowing a steady tone. It's loud enough to pierce through jet noise, but short enough not to startle passengers. Think of it as the airplane's doorbell for ground communication. It ensures coordination when radio contact isn't available. Yet another detail hiding behind the quiet precision of airport operations. Every few minutes during a flight, fresh air rushes into the cabin, mixes with filtered air, and exits through vents beneath the floor. The process is constant, pressurizing the cabin while keeping it breathable and clean. Modern jets use HEPA filtration, high-efficiency particulate air, the same standard used in hospital operating rooms. The system removes viruses, bacteria, and dust with 99.97% efficiency. Air is fully refreshed every two to three minutes, far cleaner than in most office buildings. Those vents near your feet are part of this closed loop system. They regulate pressure and prevent cold drafts, creating a stable environment even as the outside temperature drops to minus 50 degrees Celsius. It's a marvel of engineering that most people never think about, but it's why long flights remain comfortable and safe for the body, even across continents. Landing is one of the harshest moments in aviation physics. Tires hit the runway at 150 to 170 miles per hour, spinning from zero to full speed in a split second. Yet blowouts are almost unheard of. Each tire holds up to 38 tons and is inflated to around 200 PSI, six times that of a car tire. The rubber compound is embedded with carbon fibers to dissipate static electricity. Instead of one large wheel, multiple smaller tires share the impact, distributing load evenly. Maintenance teams inspect and retread tires after about 30 landings. A single set may survive hundreds of flights before replacement. It's this redundancy, multiple wheels, multiple tires, and constant monitoring that allows even the world's largest jets to touch down safely every time. Airplane windows are masterpieces of material science. Each is made of three acrylic layers, an outer pressure pane, a middle backup pane, and an inner scratch shield for passengers. The small hole at the bottom of the inner pane, called the breather hole, balances air pressure between layers. Without it, pressure differences could make the inner window bulge or crack. This design dates back to the 1950s, when early jetliners suffered disasters due to square windows that concentrated stress at their corners. Circular designs and layered structures solve that problem permanently. Today, every window can withstand several times the cabin's internal pressure, and that tiny hole you see is the reason your window stays clear and intact flight after flight. On the newest long-haul aircraft, lighting isn't just cosmetic, it's medical. LED systems mimic the color of natural sunlight, shifting slowly from warm orange to cool blue tones during flight. This technology, called human-centric lighting, helps regulate melatonin, the hormone that controls sleep. By simulating sunrise and sunset, it reduces jet lag by synchronizing passengers' body clocks with destination time zones. The system also improves comfort. Softer lighting before landing eases eye strain, while cooler tones during boarding create alertness. It's one of the few airplane features designed not for safety, but for how your brain perceives time, making international travel less exhausting and more humane. Hidden behind discreet doors or above the ceiling are tiny rooms that few passengers ever see, crew rest modules. On long haul flights lasting more than eight hours, Aviation law requires that pilots and flight attendants have a place to sleep. These compartments include bunk beds, reading lights, and even small entertainment screens. They're built into the aircraft's fuselage or cargo area, insulated for sound and equipped with emergency oxygen supplies. Access doors are often marked only with a keypad or small latch labeled crew only. While passengers rest in reclining seats, the people responsible for their safety rest in secret quarters just meters away ensuring they're alert when it matters most. The final feature isn't on today's aircraft yet, 
but it represents one of aviation's most ambitious safety visions. Engineers have tested a design where the entire passenger cabin can separate from the fuselage during a catastrophic failure. In the concept, the detachable cabin is fitted with parachutes and floats, allowing it to descend safely to the ground or water. Prototypes have proven technically possible, but the system adds massive weight and complexity, reducing efficiency. Still, research continues because the idea captures aviation's ultimate goal, not just preventing crashes, but making survival guaranteed. Many of the features we use today, from reinforced cockpit doors to oxygen generators, began as radical concepts just like this one. Every flight you take is a moving museum of human ingenuity, thousands of invisible systems working together to make something extraordinary feel ordinary. From spirals on engines to the glow of adaptive lighting, each detail exists for a reason, shaped by decades of design, tragedy, and progress. So next time you fasten your seatbelt and look around the cabin, remember, the safest way to fly is also the most misunderstood. If you enjoyed uncovering these hidden airplane features, subscribe to Epic Voyage and join us as we continue exploring the world's untold travel secrets, one flight at a time.